<laughs> I need Bob Ross. Anyway, <laughs> all right, well, welcome to our lecture online. And here we have an interesting contraption. The idea is how much force is required for the person to pull himself up at a constant speed, which, by the way, would be the exact same amount of force required just to hold everything in place. It looks difficult, but it's actually quite simple. So what we're going to assume is that the person has a weight equal to W. So the W is equal to the mass times acceleration to the gravity of the person in the chair combined, for example. All right. So now, since we have this string going around this pulley, this pulley, and up to the ceiling, and assuming that the pulleys have no mass and no friction. If that is the case, that means that the tension on this side must equal the tension on this side, which is the same as the tension here, which is the same as the tension there. But in other words, the tension is the same everywhere. Then we're going to draw a free body diagram. Hmm, where do we do that? Well, we'll draw it like this. Let me go ahead and go, we'll draw the free body diagram like this. All right, so with everything included in the diagram, what's pulling up and what's pulling down? Well, notice relative to the hand, this string is pulling up, so we have a tension going in this direction. Relative to this pulley, this is pulling up, and relative to this pulley, this is pulling up. So these are the forces pulling up on this pulley and the person in the diagram or in the free body diagram and then we have the force pulling down and that would be the weight of the person in the chair throw the chair in there with it all right now we use the equation the sum of all the forces in the y direction must add up to zero so we have three times the tension pulling up minus the weight pulling down equals zero or three times the tension equals the weight of the person or the tension required is equal to the weight divided by three and since the force here is equal to the tension, the force equals the tension, that means the force required is equal to one-third the weight of the person. So this contraption will allow someone to pull themselves up by pulling with a force equal to one-third the weight that they are. So if it's a 180-pound person, they need to pull with a force of 60 pounds. If it's a, let's say, 90-kilogram person, they need to pull with a, well, an equivalent force of, that would be on a mass of 30 kilograms. Essentially, one-third the weight of the person is what you need to pull that person up. So it's a nice little contraption, and most people should be able to do that. And that is how it's done.